Hello again, my name is Bernie of the Yensei FLI with another Q&A session. All right, this week's question, could you explain the usage of the word well-being? One more time, could you explain the usage of the word well-being? All right, first of all, let me say, this word is a noun, and the definition is the suitable condition that someone or something should be in. That involves such things as being happy, healthy, comfortable, safe, and so forth. One more time. The definition is the suitable condition that someone or something should be in that involves such things as being happy, healthy, comfortable, safe, and so forth. Here are, here are some examples. Number one, it is natural for mothers and fathers to constantly worry about their children's current and future well-being. One more time, it is natural for mothers and fathers to constantly worry about their children's current and future well-being. Num number two, many companies, especially construction companies, have strict safety regulations to protect the well-being of their workers. One more time, many companies, especially construction companies, have strict safety regulations to protect the well-being of their workers. Number three, Formula One racers constantly risk their well-being for the chance of fame and fortune. One more time, Formula One, Formula One racers constantly risk their well-being for the chance of fame and fortune. And as a closing note, once again, I want to emphasize this word is a noun and not an adjective. In Korea, I've seen some awkward phrases like well-being restaurant, well-being food, well-being salad, etc. So be sure to use this word as a noun and not an adjective. All right. So my name is Bernie Kim, trying to look out for your well-being. I'll catch you next time.